Hey everybody, today we're going to be reading Windows by Julia Dennis, illustrated by F.B. Goodale. I love seeing all the different sizes and shapes of windows. Sometimes when I'm on a walk and I look up at the windows in the buildings, I like to imagine what the stories are inside the windows. Okay, let's get started. Windows by Julia Dennis, illustrated by E. B. Goodale. At the end of the day, before the town goes to sleep, you can look out your window. and see more little windows lit up like eyes in the dusk, blinking awake as the lights turn on inside a neighborhood of paper lanterns. You can take a walk out your door into the almost night. He's got a little take his dog for the walk. You might pass a cat or an early raccoon taking a bath in squares of yellow light. The light's coming out in the window. One window might be tall with the curtains drawn or small with a party inside. Between two windows, there could be a phone used for good ideas. Phone. There might be a hug, some air conditioning and a kitty cat, or a piano. And someone might be learning to dance. Look, this is a dance studio. There's an artist. Another window could be dark with a sleeping plant or two, or maybe bright and rounded like the moon. Some windows will have dinner or TV. It's got birds all in it. And people are doing yoga. There's a sewing machine in that one. And dress. Others are empty and leave you to fill them up with stories. Oh, beware of the dog. Looks very spooky. I wonder who used to live there. Then you arrive home again, and you look at your window from the outside. Someone you love is waving at you, and you can't wait to go in. So you do.